That was a personalized vlog, so that one is not going on my channel. That one's just for you. Best vlog yet. I like the sound of that. That was the best vlog yet. So it's my best friend's birthday and one of my really good friend's weddings. And I know what you guys are thinking. I have to decide between the two things. That's not the conflict. Actually, before I get into this conflict, let me tell you about a moment this morning where I thought I was gonna die. I have the attention span of a squirrel sometimes. But earlier today, I went in my closet because I was, you know, getting changed after I showered. And look at what was staring me in the face when I opened the closet door. So, I mean, I thought the only logical thing possible was that I was getting haunted by a ghost and I was about to die. What I think actually happened is Roxy got into our Halloween decorations downstairs brought it up in her mouth and let it go in our closet. Although when I say that, it sounds like a real long shot. Ugh. All right, so for the last like year and two months, Sam and I have done a great job quarantining. But this week, like I said, it's my best friend Steve's birthday and he's having it at a place called Top Golf where there's gonna be a lot of people. Then later in the week, it's my good friend Chelsea's wedding where there's also gonna be a lot of people. Now, I was lucky. I live in Pennsylvania, so I was just able to get the vaccine a couple days ago. So now I have to make the decision. Do I have to tell my best friend that I'm not going to go to his birthday party or my really good friend that I'm not going to go to her wedding? So obviously I did decide to go to my buddy's birthday party at Top Golf. We had an awesome time. They kept us all socially distanced, so I felt safe the entire night. But today I've got a really busy day. I'm actually heading over to get a haircut right now. Then I'm going to go to the post office to work on something that you guys are really going to like. I'll tell you about that later. And then I mentioned last week that I had the opportunity to meet a young man named Landon from the Make-A-Wish Foundation. Well, today is the day I'm actually going to get to meet him. So if you guys have ever seen my vlogs, you know mail time is one of the biggest segments on my channel. Well, now I'm opening up mail time to you guys. So I just went to the post office. I got a P.O. box. Well, technically, they didn't give me the P.O. box yet because they have to verify my address. I don't really know what that means. But going forward, once I get the P.O. box, you guys are going to be able to send me stuff from all over the world. And if you're lucky, it'll make it into mail time. <laughs> So in case you were wondering, gardening, yeah, it's it's still not my thing. I bought those jalapenos like a week and a half ago and somehow I already killed them. I feel like I probably could have done nothing to them and they would have lived longer. But anyway, I mentioned last week that the Make-A-Wish Foundation reached out to me and today I could finally give you guys a little more information. The name of the young man is Landon. He's unfortunately been battling cancer for a while now and today I finally get to meet him. So we're gonna be doing a little Zoom call in a little bit. We're gonna talk about YouTube. We're gonna talk about vlogging and a bunch of other stuff. Can you guys hear me? We can. Yes. yes. Awesome. How you doing, Landon? Good. Yeah. Liking, <laughs> clicking, liking all he's, your videos. He's on your videos, clicking. I like. I like. <laughs> oh, I like that. I like hitting the like button. <laughs> How many videos Brandon has, Brandon? You know the numbers. One thousand, about one thousand five hundred. I probably wouldn't have known that number, so he's closer than I was. <laughs> Landon, Landon, Landon. So I've heard you're interested in vlogging and you're looking for a little help. Well, let's just say I hope you brought your notepad today. That was a personalized vlog, so that one is not going on my channel. That one's just for you. Best vlog yet. I like the sound of that. That was the best vlog go. yet. So I heard you're going to start. Have you started your channel or are you planning on starting your own channel soon? I'm planning on my first video tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow. Nice. Well, hey, you're going to be in the vlog. So if you know the name of the channel, shout it out right now. Maybe some people can come over. Here we go. I'm going to put it up on the screen so everybody can see it. Subscribe to a cure. Good luck on your YouTube channel. <laughs> well, good luck to you too. I don't know exactly when it's going to arrive because I didn't send it, but look out in the mail. I will be sending this um, 
It, it should come hopefully within the next couple weeks. I'll try to send it tomorrow. Hi. See you, Landon. <laughs> okay, that was absolutely awesome. Landon, if you are watching this video, it was a pleasure to meet you. Thank you so much for being so kind. I was nervous. You looked calm. I was the nervous one there. That was an absolute honor, guys. I really don't know what else to say. All right, so Steve just got this really new golf simulator where apparently you hit it into the net and this thing tells you how far you hit it, how much spin you got, and all this other cool stuff. So we're gonna give it a shot. Just hope we don't hit a car. I wear a suit and tie like once a year. I gotta take one cool slow-mo shot. All right, so we did decide to go to the wedding. I'm actually really excited to see some of my friends that I haven't seen in like a year and a half. It's all the way out by the Jersey Shore. So we have like an hour and a half drive and of course we're running late. Nice. Oh, oh, the windows don't open. How am I supposed to fly my drone? Excuse me, sir. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's hard to tell who you are because you got the mask on. <laughs> The wedding was a ton of fun. It was great seeing some of my friends that I haven't seen in over a year. But more importantly, as long as you guys never see footage of me singing and dancing at this wedding, I'll count it as a win. Oh.